Hello, everyone, and welcome to our Ask the Formulator series. My name is Beatriz Amaral. I am the cosmetic scientist here at Formula Botanica. And today I'll answer the question, what exactly are oleogels? So you are probably already familiar with water-based gels, like those made with natural gums. But oleogels are a little bit different because they are oil-based. So they are formulations um, that are made with oils, but they have a gel-like texture. This can be achieved with specific ingredients made to thicken oils. And there are some types of oleogels that will change their texture once they are in contact with water. So they create a milky texture when water is added to them. So they can be used as cleansers. And these are amazing formulations. They are very fun to use and to formulate. You can create various types of oleogels. You can use them as cleansers, as masks. You can add um, scrub particles to them so you can create exfoliating products. So they are very, very easy to make. Usually the ingredients are very easy to find and these formulations do not require any heating unless you are using ingredients that need to be melted. And well, I don't know if it's more fun to use or to formulate them. I love both. And you can create uh, these oleogels using ingredients like sucre gel, AOF Bio, or sapo gel Q. There are also other options, but I think these two are the most common ones. Um, also, another very interesting characteristic of these formulations is that as they are oil-based, and you can add a little bit of water to them around a maximum of 4%, um, as they contain very little water and are mostly based on oils they, and they contain a high amount of glycerin as well, they are mostly self-preserving. That means that uh, depending on the packaging you use and the risk of the consumer, the user introducing water to the product or not, you can formulate them without preservatives because they will be mostly self-preserving. And you can create beautiful formulations using colored plant oils, plant-based extracts, and many other interesting oil-based active ingredients. You can include um, a small amount of water-based ingredients as well, as I mentioned. These formulations are very versatile. You can get really creative with them. So it's a really uh, fun uh, place to get started with all your gels. And and check our content. We have some blog posts about olive gel cleansers and give, it a, give them a try if you can, because they are really, really fun to make and to use. I hope I've helped to answer this question and see you next time.